Wearing dresses is a very difficult job, so I'm not enjoying this kind of big event. So, but I was, yes, last year maybe I was nervous, I'm not sure about that. It was a big surprise. And then this year I need to prepare the, some, you know, speech for the, as a presenter. So it, it's, it's difficult. <laughs> My pronunciation, everything. We're same because I hang around with the same friend and I'm living in the same house. No difference. <laughs> I think it means a lot for the sense that people already have, if they can stand subtitles, that great films are made everywhere. But it's also great for the Oscars, that more and more people are feeling that the films that represent their country, their part of the world, is getting recognized. So I think it's a very good thing and we feel very grateful about it. Can I look here please? Come on here. It's a, always, it's a biggest compliment. I mean, it's like, a, as a filmmaker, you feel always lonely in some ways, and when you are like uh, celebrated by your peers, it's like it's being part of a bigger family. I love it. I will see that uh, more very specifically. There's one of the first scenes we shot where um, Timothée Chalamet had to perform something on one of the very first day. Uh, it was a, we were shooting the gum jabbar scene, a torture scene, where his character had to go through some kind of psychological transformation. And I, I, when I saw that happening on, on the camera, I, I, well, I knew that I had a, a, a special movie in my hands because I knew I had to find the right actor to embody uh, uh, Paul Atreides. Uh, there will definitely be more Zendaya in the, in the second film, I promise. It's very important uh, because uh, it's unacceptable uh, that uh, now it's happening something that belongs to the past of the world. And uh, so I think that in every moment uh, we should uh, let you know to everybody that uh, it's no time for war anymore. Yeah. The, the people in Italy are very warm with me and very patient, so I am very happy to, to, to represent the Italy in this uh, wonderful uh, moment.